Masada, and all of a sudden we see this man, and he's writing in the scribe, and he was very observant, and we said, Wendy. Oh, so um, all the girls in our group, my new sisters, encouraged me to go up uh, to him and ask him if he would do a blessing and write a letter in the Torah from, on behalf of my daughter, Melanie Rose Chait, uh, because she is struggling with a... Um, a very challenging disease, and he asked me about her, he asked me about what she's dealing with, it was very personal, and uh, he gave a letter in her name, and then he wrote this for us, and I'm going to have it framed or maybe put inside a piece of jewelry for her, and it says, please uh, heal me, please heal me. And he said a blessing for me and for her, and I was so grateful. It was so magnificent and enhancing of the whole experience is that I was at the back of the line, and there were a lot of women in front of me, and all the women in my group pushed me to the front of the line. And we all had our arms around her on our shoulders. Yeah, and all the girls in the group embraced me. I'm getting the goosebumps again just thinking about it, but they all sacrificed their own opportunity for a blessing so that I could provide the blessing for my daughter, which I will be eternally grateful. And, hope, and Darlene had a very um, similar And experience. then when I saw that Wendy was doing this for her daughter, I said, I better take this opportunity for my son Dylan, I am Joseph, and he has autism. How old is he? And I told him he's eight, and he said he likes music. And I thought, how does he know that? And he wrote something having to do with music, that there'll be new songs or something for him with music for his future and a change in his life. So we're so grateful. And it was beautiful. And I'm a nurse, and I cannot believe like that these two ladies got this blessing in the middle of Masada on Lagba Omar. He was writing a Sefer Torah, and he just in like this little cave room with air conditioning, and he was with a beard and just concentrating at the top of Mount Sinai. And, and then Helene got one then, also. Well, um, <laughs> the three of us but got anyway, a blessing. But like, I hope as a nurse, like you know, I mean, that's like medical, but this is totally mystical, spiritual. These ladies. May all the blessings that he gave you come true. Say Amen. Amen. Amen.